Okay, I'm going to have to do this as an upload or as a premiere on the iPad because the connection's just playing up as usual. This is the Champions League draw for the 2019-2020 to campaign. This is a group stage draw. Teams from the same country, so Bayern Munich especially uh, can't play anyone from Germany. Um, teams from England can't play against each other. Teams from Russia and Ukraine cannot play against each other either. And... That's practically it as far as I'm concerned. Wesley Snyder is doing the draw for us, ladies and gentlemen. And the first ball is Paris Saint-Germain. PSG goes straight into Group A. And this team, the next team will go into Group B, I believe. And that is FC Bayern München. FC Bayern München into Group B. And the next team to go into Group C. Man City going to Group C. Also, I forgot to say, the pots are organised from, I think, team quality. So, basically, whoever finishes top or win the actual tournament are into Group Pot 1. Teams from the same pot cannot play against each other either. Red just going to Group D. And we have the usual classic drink today. It returns. It's the Iron Brew. Before Scotty B asks me. Liverpool going to Group E. E. So group F, Barcelona. Group G, will it be Chelsea or Senate? One into Group G. Then it said Petersburg in Russia. And to finish pot one, into Group H, go Chelsea, the Europa League champions. Chelsea go into Group H. To let you know, I forgot to say that uh, Alisson, the Liverpool goalkeeper, has been named goalkeeper of the season from the last campaign. The UEFA President's Award has gone to Eric Cantona and it's now time for the UEFA Best Defender of the Season and it is Virgil van Dijk. Here we go then, it's time for Pot 2 and the first team out of the balls is Tottenham Hotspurs. Tottenham Hotspurs are the first team out of pot two. Tottenham Hotspurs will go into Group B. Oh, they've got Bayern. You would would have would you just know it? When I did the predictions yesterday, Bayern got Tottenham Hotspurs in their group, and they've got Tottenham in their group. Next team's AFC Ajax, and this is where all the eight pots of balls come into it. They will go into Group H with Chelsea. Edwin van der Sar will enjoy that. He's got some good memories of uh, playing against Chelsea and actually beating them in the Champions League final. Borussia Dortmund. Now, they got Liverpool when I did the draw. Borussia Dortmund go into Group F. They go in with not Liverpool. They go in with Barcelona. Esso Benfica of Portugal. Group G for Porto, they play Senate St. Petersburg. And the next team, please. It's the former holders, Real Madrid CF. They could play against Liverpool. They go into Group A. Real Madrid will play Paris Saint-Germain. Team is Shakhtar Donetsk. Shakhtar Donetsk. Shakhtar go into Group C. Napoli are the next team. There's only two groups left, and that is... Oh, Juventus and Liverpool. Napoli will automatically go into Liverpool's group because teams from the same country can't play against each other. Liverpool play Napoli once again, exactly the same as last season. Atletico Madrid... And they will go into Juventus's group, which is Group D. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the UEFA Champions League midfielder of the season 2018-19. And it is AFC Ajax's Dutch international, Frankie de Jong. 
It's time for pot free. Pot free. First team is Inter Milan. Inter Milan will go into group. Group F. Bayer Leverkusen next team out. Group D. Valencia CF. We'll go into group H and join Chelsea. FC Salzburg. Salzburg. FC Salzburg. I should go into group E and we'll join Liverpool. Dynamo Zagreb. To group C. Olympiakos of Greece. We'll go into group. Group B, so Bayern Munich take on Tottenham and Olympiakos. Club Bruges of Belgium, they will go into Group A. Finally, Olympia, Olympic Lyonnais will go into the uh, Senate and Benfica group, which is Group G. UEFA Champions League forward of the season, and without a shadow of a doubt, guess who it is? It's Lionel Messi. It's time for the final pot, pot four. Here we go then. First team out with the balls. <laughs> Atalanta. Atalanta. So, group C. Red Bull Leipzig. Now, they cannot go into group F or group B. Can't go into Leverkusen's group either. Group G, so they join Senate St. Petersburg. I'll do the full draw after this is completed. Locomotive Moscow. Locomotive Moscow will go into Group D. And the next team, please, is SK Slavia Praha of Czech Republic. Or as I have a habit of calling them, Slavia Prague. Group F, so they go in. They have to... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Slavia Prague go into the toughest group yet. Barca, Dortmund and Milan. Lille of France. The French League Earn team. Of course, they've just lost Nicolas Pepe to Arsenal. Lille go into group H with Chelsea. So Chelsea don't actually have an easy group. KRC Genk of the Belgian Pro League. And Genk go into Liverpool's group. FK Cavernus Festa, or known as Red Star Belgrade of Serbia. Yep, Group B. Bayern travel to Serbia. Next one's Galatasaray. <laughs> Galatasaray of the Turkish Super League will go into PSG and Real Madrid's group. That's the draw, and here's the groups in full. In Group A, we have PSG, Real Madrid, Club Bruges, and Galatasaray. Group B, Bayern München, Tottenham Hotspurs, Olympiacos, and Cavernas Fezda. In Group C, is Manchester City, Shakhtar Donetsk, Dynamo Zagreb, and Atalanta. In Group D, Juventus, Club Atletico de Madrid, by Nulfia Leverkusen and Lokomotiv Moscow. In Group E, it's Liverpool, the current holders, Napoli, Red Bull Salzburg and KRC Genk. In Group F is FC Barcelona, Borussia Dortmund, FC International Milano and SK Slavia Praha. Group G's Football Club, Senate St. Petersburg, SL Benfica, Olympic Lyonnais, and Red Bull Leipzig. And in Group H, it's Chelsea FC, AFC Ajax, Valencia SCF, and Losk Lille. That concludes the Champions League draw for the 2019-20 group stage. A tough group for Bayern, and an enthralling group for Barcelona, and an enthralling group for Chelsea. Best of luck to every single team in this tournament. But that's it. We're back tomorrow with the UEFA Europa League draw. Uh, which features which features uh, 12, 12 groups and features 48 teams. So 
There's a lot of teams in the Europa League. Looking forward to it. We'll see you tomorrow for the Europa League draw. And hopefully it'll work live. Thanks for watching. All the best. And we'll see you for that. Bye.